What's going on, guys? Welcome to a brand new playthrough of Spider-Man, aka Spider-Man, uh, for the PS4. Uh, a lot of people played this shit already, so you probably know what the dealio is. But uh, I'm gonna play through it, and this is a new game plus because I already beat this shit. So uh, I think I'm gonna go ultimate. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah, this is probably just gonna be a chill playthrough of me playing Spider-Man. And, uh, I'm gonna let you guys, like, listen to the story and stuff if you've never seen it before. But, uh, yeah, everything looks good to go. Alright. Let's get this show on the road. Hope everybody had a good, uh, New Year's. And, uh... Christmas holiday, you know, um, I didn't really do much myself, personally, um, found my capture card, though, which was great, because, uh, that's kind of what was stopping me from doing these videos, because, uh, lost that shit, but, uh, found it now, so all is well, uh, I'm gonna stop talking for a sec, so you guys can check out, well, actually, no, there's really nothing important going on here. Um, in other news, I got my Crash Bandicoot statue in the, in, in, in the mail today, and, uh, that was pretty exciting to come home to, and, yeah, I don't know, it's just a neat little statue that was on sale. That was my day, but, um, yeah, love Spider-Man, uh, let's talk about that. Who doesn't love Spider-Man, though? And, um... That Into the Spider-Verse movie was great. Uh, if you guys haven't seen that shit yet, I uh, highly recommend you go do that. I don't know what you're waiting on. But uh, damn near one of the best Spider-Man movies, if not the best. But, uh, you know, uh, I don't really got anything too bad to say about all the other Spider-Man movies that I grew up with. Um, you know, they're hilarious to go back to and watch. Because of... Uh, how terrible they are but um you know i think they're doing it justice now with uh tom holland uh man i've seen i've gone back to rewatch infinity war like so many times and every time i watch it it's just like man my god this movie exists and that's crazy to even like comprehend and it's so it's so good Anyways, so yeah, this game was made by Insomniac, the same people who make uh, Ratchet and Clank, another one of my childhood favorites. Um, Sunset Overdrive, uh, that, that one game that no one cared about, Fuse, uh, Resistance, just to name a few. They made Spyro, the original three. Oh, wow, okay, so I start with my, <laughs> I start with a different costume. So what I plan on doing is wearing a different costume for every episode, just to, like, switch it up. Um, I guess I'll start with this one? I don't know, I kind of want to make it more, like, uh, kind of like the story. So, for this episode, I'll just wear, like, the original costume, I guess. Do I even have it unlocked, though, is the question. Uh, no, let's unlock it right now. Why not? Cool. So we'll start with the, the OG, triple OG costume. And, um, yeah. So, you know, you just start off, and you're fucking Spider-Man. And, yeah, that's the game, pretty much. It's exactly how you'd expect it. You just swing around, but, uh, it's so good. I'm probably not doing it any justice, but man, when you just like, it's so therapeutic to just chill, swing around, be fucking Spider-Man, you know? Who doesn't want to be Spider-Man? Feels great. Anyways, so in this, uh, this version of Spider-Man, you're like in your uh, mid-twenties, I think. You're already grown man, Peter, basically, you know? Um, all the shit, all the important shit has gone down, I guess. 
run through the demonstration at least once before the grand committee I feel like arrives. you guys should probably be listening to this. I'm sorry if I'm talking too much. I'm really glad I have an excuse to go back and play this, though. This is such a good game. Definitely uh, one of the best of 2018. But you know that God of War was just so goddamn amazing. It's it's, it's hard to beat, you know. But uh, fucking Spider-Man. Can't complain about that. So here we go. We start off normal everyday Spider-Man shit. Solving crime. Solving crime. The stopping crime. Speaking of uh, Spider-Man, that season two of uh, Punisher is about to come out on Netflix. And I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty uh, geeked for that. Sucks that they canceled Daredevil, but I think the Punisher was way more interesting. But, uh... Yeah, I kind of stopped caring about, like, all the other shit after Daredevil Season 2. I don't even think I've seen the new season, actually. But, anyways, uh, enough about Daredevil. Oh, shit, I forgot how to play. Um, okay. So, the fighting, like, the combat in this game is pretty much like Arkham, like Batman. Those games. I really hope you guys can't just hear me fucking tapping the controller. Because that's going to be annoying. I'll try to... I'll try to, like... Have the game volume higher, I guess. Because I do have the mic, like, directly next to the controller. Meow. Meow. So yeah, uh, I actually haven't seen the Venom movie though, um, just cause, you know, I was so torn, I was so split about, I heard so much bad about it, and some people said it was okay, and it just, it never ended up happening, and yeah, I don't know, maybe it'll like drop on Netflix or something someday, and I'll catch it then. So let's see, where are we at right now? Yuri. Okay. I'm debating on how long I want to make these episodes. Man, you just gotta like soak it in that you're fucking Spider-Man and like, oh my god. Flip it around, you know? Feels so good. There's DLC for this that uh, recently dropped, and there's three chapters, and I'm on chapter three, and I haven't beat it yet. Um, I told myself I was going to beat it before I came back and played it again, but you know what? I wanted to wanted to play some shit for you guys, so yeah, here's Spider-Man. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Wait, I think... Because I'm playing New Game Plus, I have all of my, like, upgrades already. Yeah, I think I'm already, like, level fucking whatever. That's so cool. I mean, yeah. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'll just be stronger. But I am playing on a harder difficulty, so see how that goes. I just gotta get back in the groove of it. It's been a minute. The controls for this game are so like Spider-Man specific. Like you can't play another game and then come back to this. And then just like instantly know what the fuck you're doing. 
But I think I'm not doing a bad job. Either that or this is just like super easy. Cool. So basically the way you like have health in this game is you like beat people up to like gain energy and then once you uh, fill your energy bar up you could just replace your health with that and that's kind of how that works which is like a similar mechanic to kind of like Hollow Knight which I've play I've also been playing on my Switch. I don't know if anyone cares about that. But, uh, yeah. Great game. I think that's all of them. Definitely recommend it. If you have, like, on, I think it's, on. like, what, 15 bucks or some shit like that to spend on, like, some rando indie game. I prefer a more direct approach. Alright, so we run up here, do some more Spider-Man shit. This is so cool, though. I remember playing the first Spider-Man on fucking PS1 when you couldn't, like, touch the ground. Like, the whole game just took place in, on the fuck, in, in the sky. But, like, you didn't even care because you were fucking zipping around like Spider-Man. And then Spider-Man 2 dropped. And you're like, whoa, ground? I can't even process this. My problem with this game is that it's so fucking gorgeous that every, literally everything I do, I want to pause it and like, do photo mode and take a picture of some shit. And I end up doing that shit for so long that, like, I, it wastes a lot of time. Uh, it takes away a lot of time of me actually playing the game. Just because I'm, like, always trying to take photos. And I have that same problem with Assassin's Creed. But, uh, I think that just means, you know, we got some fucking some gorgeous games now, man. It's, it's crazy to see how far we've come. From fucking... What did I start off with? I started with some Brash Bandicoot. That was the first game I ever beat. Was some fucking Crash Bandicoot Warped. The first game I remember playing, I think might might have been Ocarina of Time on the 64. Uh, shout out my cousin Lupe. Um, but yeah. That shit, that blew my mind. That was just so difficult. What am I supposed to be doing here? I'm not really even paying attention. What? I'm supposed to activate, like, my Spidey Sense or something? Enter the server room. What? Oh, okay. That's what I get for not paying attention. So, a uh, little bit of backstory for people who don't know. Um, also, just because I'm pretty sure no one cares. There we go. Uh... When Insomniac was approached uh, by Marvel about making this game, they basically like gave them the option to choose any Marvel character that they wanted to make a video game of. And they all like mutually agreed on Spider-Man. The studio did. And I hope I'm going the fucking right way. Okay. Um, but yeah. So it's crazy to think like what another Marvel game would look like compared to this. Because this is so fucking good. You kind of think like, man, what if, you know... I mean, there's been other Spider-Man games. Uh, well, there's been fucking crazy amount of Spider-Man games in the past. But, you know, they've, they've always been kind of meh. You know? Like, there's a couple of good ones that, here and there. But this is definitely, like, the perfect tribute piece to Spider-Man. And... If this formula was, like, applied to a different Marvel character, 
uh, it'd just be, I don't know, it'd be super interesting. I want it to be someone that, like, we haven't seen a whole lot of, like, um, maybe not, like, seen a whole lot of, but, like, a character that hasn't really been in the spotlight just because I feel like it'd be more interesting to tell a story about them than, like, something we've seen a thousand times. But Spider-Man's different because, you know, it's fucking Spider-Man. And they haven't really, like, done him right until now. So, that's, like, good to see. But, like, imagine a, imagine a Thor game, like, God of War style. Or, like, I don't know. Moon Knight is basically fucking Batman. Okay, I'm slacking right now. Um, yeah, I don't know. Iron Man would be cool, I guess. Those are hella basic, though. Daredevil would basically just be like another Spider-Man. So hard. Because, well... I don't know, just, just game design in general. But I don't even want to get into that. I forget exactly why I'm like doing all of this right now. Um, oh yeah, so let's see, I plan, I'm thinking of making these episodes like around 20 minutes each maybe i feel like that's a good amount of time for a lengthy game like this one um yeah not having too much of a challenge right now i'm not sure if this like hard mode has been activated yet or this is just like still the tutorial area but it's all good because I also want you guys to to see it as if you because I'm sure there's people out there who haven't played it you know not everyone has a PS4 I get that where am I supposed to be going ah I just get electrocuted oh shit I actually like how this first costume looks and I was actually tripping when I first bought this game and I was playing it and it started off in this costume and I thought you were supposed to be in the, the other costume with the white spider already and I was like did I get like some alternate edition where you like instantly start off in a different costume but that was the stupidest shit I don't know why I would think of it honestly I also had no idea who Yuri is before this game either. So, yeah, I'm not sure where she's from. She I. Um. Fuck. I'm really fucking hungry. That's like all I can think of right now. Does that dude have blonde hair? Or am I tripping? Meow. Fucking hate these RPG guys. Okay. So, yeah, getting ready to close off this first episode here. Um, let me know if you guys are interested in seeing more. Um, I plan on playing some more Spider-Man. I had some other games in mind, but I just figured Spider-Man would be the mo most interesting. I don't know, because, like, who doesn't like Spider-Man? But, 
there's a lot of other shit I want to play. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any recommendations, I'm always open. Uh, I plan on streaming some shit, too. So, yeah. Just, uh, you know, keep an eye out for more Spider-Man. And, uh, yeah, thanks again. Oh, God. oh shit. Thanks. Thanks again, guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.